the Open Microcontroller Trainer. As its name suggests, the De Lorenzo Open Microcontroller Trainer is a didactic trainer that allows the student to study the principles of microcontrollers in an easy and practical way. It is a complete tool for developing your own applications on electronic circuits and microcontroller programming. This trainer was conceived with the idea of developing and implementing the Lorenzo products by means of programming an Arduino card and the data acquisition system of the national instrument, the Lab View. This system therefore allows any person to study control systems by means of developing data acquisition methods. With this trainer, students can program their own microcontrollers and connect it to the system through a suitable interface. The card interface links the microcontroller world with the De Lorenzo world. Through this card, it is possible to add separate options to increment the functions of the microcontroller, such as Wi-Fi or joystick. However, these cards are not included. The microcontroller is based on the Arduino technology. What is Arduino? Arduino is an electronic board in small dimensions with a microcontroller that allows you to create prototypes and small devices such as controllers for lighting, for controlling the speed of a motor, etc. Sensors and multitude of projects, for example, interactive objects. The microcontroller collects information from the environment through its analog and digital inputs. Arduino is therefore a tool for making computers that can sense and control more of the physical world than a normal desktop computer. It is the brain of the system. Arduino projects can be standalone or can also communicate with software running on your computer, for example, flash or processing. The integrated board on this trainer is the Arduino Uno. It is a microcontroller board based on the Atmeg 328. It has digital input and output pins, analogical inputs, a USB connection, a power jack, an ICSP header, and a reset button. It can be powered through a USB cable or with an AC to DC adapter or battery. Here are a few examples of the trainer's technical data. It has 14 digital input and output pins, of which six of them can be used as PWM outputs. It has six analogical inputs and 16 MHz crystal oscillator. Its operating voltage is 5 volts, with a recommended input voltage of 7 to 12 volts, whereas the input voltage limits are 6 to 20 volts, in order to avoid overheating and damage to the board. It has 32 kilobytes of flash memory, of which 0.5 kilobytes are used by bootloader and has also 2 kilobytes of SRAM and 1 kilobyte of FIDPROM. The microcontroller of the board can be managed with an Arduino programming language and the Arduino development environment. It consists of an own language based on wiring and on processing respectively. As you can see in this example, the programming language is similar to C++. The programming language is rather simple. It is organized in at least two parts of, or functions that enclose the block of statements. These two functions are setup and loop, indispensable for the operation of the program. The Arduino software can be downloaded for free and it can be installed in a computer running any of the following operating systems. Windows, Mac, and Linux. It is an open source software, which means that we can use, write, and modify it for free. Its hardware is also open and can be extended. It allows you to create your own version of the module, extending and improving it. At the top of the case, there is a space for the tablet, the various devices contained in the Open Microcontroller Trainer, and the section of the national instrument. At the bottom, there is the microcontroller, the interface card, and a base card where all electronic cards are assembled. 
The devices integrated in the suitcase are oscilloscope, which allows you to monitor two channels simultaneously, multimeter or tester, function generator, and a frequency analyzer. Buttons to adjust and set the oscilloscope, second or division, buttons to change the horizontal and vertical position of the channel, etc. The multimeter allows to monitor simultaneously the channel 1 and 2 in terms of voltage and frequency. It allows to generate a waveform type sign, square or triangle. Through the parameter setting, it is possible to modify the frequency, the offset, the duty cycle and the amplitude of the output. It is possible to use the internal national instrument cards to carry out specific experiments of digital or analogical data acquisition. For this they are 8 digital input or outputs, 8 analog inputs, 2 analog outputs, and a USB interface. The DeLorenzo's Open Microcontroller Trainer is provided with a tablet with Windows operating system. A USB adapter allows the connection of the tablet to the case. The standard software included within the tablet are Arduino software. Arduino Serial Scope, which is a Windows application that graphically represents serial data streams sent by Arduino. LabView Student Scope, which is an oscilloscope specifically designed to work with the data acquisition device, the National Instruments. This oscilloscope has the function of a spectrum analyzer. It allows us to visualize the spectral components in a frequency spectrum of the input signals. The base card allows to insert up to nine cards oriented to different applications and topics. The open microcontroller trainer system acts as the power supply for each card or subcard. Here is a view of the complete open microcontroller trainer with all its accessories and electronic cards. Each submodule must be inserted in a free slot. The upper and lower connectors on each submodule must match the equivalent connectors on the development module. Insert the two upper 10 pins connectors first and then the lower 10 pins connector. The educational objective of this trainer depends on the type of application to be developed by the student. As an option, the Lorenzo provides a set of BRS subboards that allows the performance of simple applications in the fields of digital electronics, analog electronics, renewable energy, and sensors. All these applications are already developed. We are continuously developing many other applications to make the DeLorenzo Open Microcontroller Trainer more versatile and flexible. The BDE subboards are a set of modules for the study of digital electronics. The case comes default with these boards, an SP01 module and a breadboard. A manual of practical exercises is available to allow students to have a simple and gradual learning the manual explains step by step what you need to write the program and how the circuit should look. This slide is an example of one of the practices included in the manual. It consists of programming the microcontroller to turn on and off a LED. The first image is a circuit diagram with its connections and the second image corresponds to the program code. Here is another example with BDE boards. It is a seven segment display that is created in binary code. The display shows numbers from 0 to 9 and the letters C, D, E and F. Here is the same practice but using the mobile phone as a controller. Arduino allows you to download free applications for Android. The BAE boards allow us to study analog electronics applications. The PSC board is a set of modules for the study of photovoltaic solar cell. Finally, the trainer can also be used to study the operation of a solar panel that follows the direction of the sunlight, thanks to a motor driven by a relay system. The Minisun tracker is the application to control the sensors of a tracker through the microcontroller. 
It consists of a two-axis solar tracker with integrated inclination sensors, orientation, humidity, and temperature. Why should one buy the De Lorenzo Open Microcontroller Trainer? First, it's because it's an open system that allows a student to explore and develop their own experiments as well as create their own applications. It allows the study of each system individually and also because it is versatile and adaptable to the continuous technological evolution. It is compact as in one product we have integrated Arduino microprocessor, LabVIEW and data acquisition products. It needs only one cable for powering. It has a great potential. And Arduino means vanguard. Finally, it is able to stimulate intuition and the logical abilities of the student.